Hello everybody, I'm Karjimo. In this video, I will do speedy survey approximately 2021 Chevrolet Tahoe Impresses with diesel power. Hope you delighted in it. In the event that you are doing, do not disregard to take off a like, comment and share it together with your friends. Also do not disregard to subscribe and turn on notice ring so you do not miss most current video from this channel. Thanks. 2021 Chevrolet Tahoe impresses with diesel power. The refinement and fuel economy of General Motors' Duramax diesel inline 6 makes for a compelling matchup with Chevy's redesigned Tahoe SUV. Diesel engines are a tough sell in the United States, particularly since the 1970s when General Motors converted a gas V8 to run on diesel for its Oldsmobile brand, which resulted in woeful reliability issues, mainly head bolts that couldn't withstand the rigors of diesel compression. The 2001 introduction of GM's powerful and stout Duramax diesel V8 and its heavy-duty trucks, the result of a joint venture with Isuzu, helped make up for that earlier, ill-fated effort with Olds. But perhaps even more compelling for drivers who don't need near big rig levels of torque is the recent addition of a light-duty Duramax inline 6, which debuted in the Chevrolet Silverado 1500 and GMC Sierra 1500 pickups and has now begun to spread to all of GM's redesigned full-size SUVs, the first of which is the latest Chevy Tahoe tested here. The turbocharged 3.0-liter Duramax is one of three engines available in the new Tahoe. Base models get a 355-horsepower 5.3-liter V8, while the top-spec High Country is powered by a standard 420-horsepower 6.2-liter small block. The diesel is the least powerful of the group at 277 horsepower, but its 460 pound-feet of torque is the same as the 6.2s. Diesel engines are usually a costly upgrade because, among other reasons, they incorporate expensive exhaust treatment systems that keep their sootier emissions in check. But that's not the case here. In high country trims like our test vehicle, the diesel comes with a $1,500 credit versus the big V8. On lesser models, the engine is but a $995 line item and the cheapest Tahoe with the Duramax starts at $53,295, a loaded high country starts at $69,395. Just be mindful that optional equipment can greatly inflate those starting figures, as exemplified by the $80k plus price of our well-equipped example. A diesel's prodigious torque output often implies a massive benefit for towing. But the 3.0-liter Duramax is rated to tow the least weight of the Tahoe's powertrains, although its still strong 8,200-pound rating in rear-drive models is but 200 pounds less than that for Tahoe's equipped with the 5.3-liter V8 and the optional max trailering package. The diesel also has an available trailering package, but it doesn't alter the truck's maximum capacity. If you're worried about a 200-pound buffer when towing, you probably need a more capable rig. Lows slower than gas V8s.